My dad once said that he likes to have his ruts so deep he can't see out of them. And I'll tell you what, we learn from our parents whether we like it or not. And for me, that can be hard sometimes because I like variety. I like to mix things up, but I find myself falling back into routine, just like my good old pops. And some days it's hard. I have to kickstart things and make a conscious, purposeful effort before I can find my groove and go out and do something fun. I haven't gone for a run in three days, and I'll tell you what, I'm starting to feel it. You know how when you get in like a slump, not like when you're sad or depressed or anything, but you're just sort of low energy, you're there, and you're just kind of clocking in and checking the boxes, but that's about it. Yeah, that's kind of how I feel today. And running for me is the fastest way I know how to like change moods and turn the day around, so to speak. I guess that's the right way to put it. It's not going bad, but I just want to improve things and make it better. So I'm just gonna get a few miles in, see how far the feet wanna go, see how far I wanna go, and just see what happens. Are these, are those ghosts or witches? Huh. We've got a gang of street kids here in front of me. Hopefully I can get by them without a problem. Okay, I got 6.29 miles, 9.13 pace. And for me, that's pretty good, especially after having taken a few days off. But the good news is, I feel pretty darned okay. I'm ready for whatever the day holds next. Okay, I figured out what the rest of the day is gonna hold. I'm gonna go to Costco, but it's not gonna be any Costco trip. I just got a pair of these Meta Wayfinder transition lens glasses. These are the ones that record when you hit the button. In fact, watch this. Oh, that was... Camera was covered by hat. Camera was covered. Wait, did you hear that? Listen. Camera was covered by hat. <laughs> it tells you when the camera is covered by hat. That's awesome. Okay, but you can video record by holding this down. And then I think like a light is shining. Yeah, it's light shining. Yeah, that's not totally obnoxious or anything, but ah, whatever, it is what it is. Anyway, I'm gonna go to Costco with these and just see what it's like. How do these transition lenses look? I, uh, I've had them on for a little while now and I don't think they're very dark. And that's too bad because I don't want people to see my look of disappointment when they do something like cut me off or take a Costco cart, turn sideways in the aisle and just stare at something on the top shelf. Oh God, why? Yeah, yeah. did you see that? Did you see that? Yeah. I think you can see that. minute review of these glasses so far 100% on ability for it to tell me that the camera was covered by the hat 0% um, on transition lenses actually blocking out light I feel like I need to put a pair of sunglasses on my sunglasses to get any sort of light reduction or maybe just stare at the Sun for a while I'm not sure which but these guys I mean transition is what they don't do There's only one thing that I actually need here at Costco, but how often you come to Costco for something you need versus just to see what they have. Okay, there we go. This is it. I need... Eh, this one looks good. All right, that thing has a very important role to serve when I get back to the house, I'll show you. It's for kid protection. Let's see what I mean. So when it comes to Christmas season, Costco definitely understood the assignment. Uh. 
that would be so cool for half that price. Oh. Final review of the in-store use of these Meta glasses. Overall, I like them. It's really good on the quick draw. Like if you see something interesting that you want to film, like without pulling out your phone, just hold this button down, you're good to go. Complete fail on the social awkwardness scale. At checkout, I saw a guy that was wearing the coolest shirt in the world, and I just could not hit this button and record him with this flashing light like three feet away from him. I just couldn't do it. <laughs> I just didn't have it in me. Oh, Meta, you're killing me with that, with the LED beacon. Well, I know why you do it, but still, it makes it very uncomfortable to use these around other people when they're like looking at you and they know what you're doing. Other than that, these things are pretty neat. Well, as long as the video comes out, I haven't seen it yet. <laughs> okay, here we go. The big reveal. The entire reason that I went to Costco to get that pad. Are you ready? That's it. Yep. I wanted to cover up five-sixths of the tile in front of our fireplace. You see, we have wee ones toddling and crawling around. And this is kind of a hazard for them. And I thought it would be a good idea to put something on top of it that would make it a little bit softer and a little bit more kid friendly. It may have been a good idea to measure ahead of time, but ah, whatever, then I wouldn't have gotten to test out the glasses. Anyway, that's it. Whole reason I went to Costco was to try to cover this and I got, well, I guess five, six, that's passing. I got mostly there. <laughs>